everybody, Wonky Puppy here bringing you another Let's Play video inside of Stardew Valley. Today is the 22nd of winter in year one of our completionist farm, and we are going to start the day off like we always do by talking to Abigail. No, by checking the weather report. Uh, welcome with Cozy Five, your number one source for weather news and entertainment. And now the weather forecast for tomorrow, it's going to be clear and sunny all day. Fantastic. Uh, let's check in with our fortune. Oh, I see a glimmer within my scrying orb, a shot of knowledge from the future. The spirits feel neutral today. The day is in your hands. Okay, well, I guess that's not bad. Uh, living off the land? Welcome to living off the land. We're back again with another tip for y'all. Now listen up. Ever see three little brown stems poking out of the ground? They're hard to spot, but sometimes... Oh, they're hard to spot sometimes, but if you dig on that spot, you'll always find something. Don't ask me how it works. <laughs> Alrighty. Uh, so that's for the little wiggly worms. Aw, a little smoochy poo from Abigail. No. Um, so I wonder if I have the things that I would need in order to uh, make a, a cooking recipe that will improve our luck. I don't know that we have all that many. Oh, we don't have. Oh, we're still missing so many recipes. We don't have the recipe for the omelet. We don't have the lucky lunch. How are we missing so many recipes? Are we actually missing these recipes or we just have, okay, we haven't, we're not actually missing these recipes. Sur surely not. Move. Ugh. I need to use, I need to use the stove, please. I need to cook. You go away. Why can't I cook? Go away. <laughs> Dang it, Abigail. Where are you going? She's just gonna like sit there and shake. I want to use the stove. Let me cook. There we go. Oh, I just made a fried egg accidentally. Whoopsie doodles. Um, so I think the lucky lunch is somewhere around here. That's one of been like one of the better things to have cooked. Uh, that or something else entirely. Um, pepper poppers. I think will also increase lunch. Farmer's lunch is good for. Um, I think it's, it gives me plus three farming, right? Yeah. Let's see, anything for luck. Luck, please. Need luck. No. No. Um, do we not have the recipe for pepper poppers? No, because I think, um, what's-his-face doesn't like us yet. Um, Shane doesn't like us yet, so he doesn't give us anything for- Okay, so we have nothing that we can cook <laughs> to improve luck, so that kind of stinks. Um, but I have a fried egg, so, you know, there's at least that. Did I already turn the fried egg in? I'm pretty sure I did. And didn't somebody need a fried egg for the community center? That sounds like something that would happen. Yeah, literally the only thing I'm gonna use is that darn red cabbage. Okay. So, uh, do I just sell this? What do I do? Oh, I need a little bit of energy. Might as well eat it. Yeah, let's just eat it. Okay, now let's go take care of our animals. And, um, well, the reason I went on that whole tirade about luck is one of the things I want to do is I want to get Dwarf Scroll 1. Because that is theoretically the easiest one to get. But the only one that I have left to get of the collection. That way I can get the Dwarf by. That way I can talk to the Dwarf. That way I can buy bombs. That way I can get more Iridium. That way I can get more Iridium Sprinklers. That is the whole reasoning behind all of this. Now I'm unsure whether or not it makes more sense to just... Uh, tough it out and try to go and get the stuff myself in the in the skull cavern or if I should be spending all this time on bombs or not because um, it's just it's just taken so much time to try to get the store scroll but I still want to try to get it so I think I'm gonna go for it uh, hopefully one of these four mixed seeds that we planted will become a red cabbage I'm really not sure if it will or not but um, that would be ideal we're gonna clear out a, a bigger area though for more mixed seeds um, once we get to 999 coffee, I think. Because I want to use the 999 coffee in the field in uh, spring, because that'll be a great source of money once they mature. Okie dokie, so we got that. We don't have any ancient fruit or anything ready quite yet. Uh, let's check in with our little bok bok friends. Let's see. Oh, little ducky ducky. Little eggy boo. Uh, we got chickens, ducks, we got rabbits, we got some wool, we got duck feathers. Oh, there's a rabbit's foot down there. Oh, that's exciting. Uh, so rabbit's feet are universal loves. They think there's only one person, one or two people that don't like them. Um, but everybody else, it's a universal love. So it's um, it's a great gift to hold on to, to give people. If you ever get into a bind and you don't have something that they love on their birthday, 
uh that is a great gift to give somebody for sure um another thing i want to do to prepare for uh winter is just reconfigure my farm a little bit i'm not super happy with the layout um i'm working on using stardew valley planner the the map planner thing uh to come up with how i want the design to be but um I'm not done with that yet i'll take a little bit more time for me to be super happy with the design uh, but I'm going to have to move the roads a little bit, I think, and I want to move the fence a little bit. Just just tweak everything just a tiny little bit, just uh, to really make it fit a little bit better. Uh, let's go ahead and pop all of our eggs and milk into the machines. And we've got some wool I can put into the loom. Uh, I think I'm going to sell the duck feather, but I'll keep the rabbit's foot for a gift. And I think I'm keeping the gifts in the green chest. Yes, looks like I am. Perfect. And now, um, okay, what I want to do is I want to grab five gold bars and I want to go over to Clint's and upgrade our watering can because we need to upgrade our watering can and we need to upgrade our hoe in order to get everything up to gold. That was one of the goals that I put for the inner winter. Um, so that stuff's over here now. <laughs> uh, let's see. One, two, three, four, five. And I think that's... Where did I keep my watering can? Oh, here it is. Perfect. Um, look at all these dwarf scrolls. I have all of these extra dwarf scrolls in here, but not one of them is dwarf squirrel one. It's infuriating. Ay, ay, ay. Oh, wiggly worms. Is this going to be an artifact? I doubt it. And it's clay. Boo. All right. Um, hey, Pam. Oh, there's a wiggly worm up there, too. Oh, and up there. Let's see, uh, mix seeds and uh, a prehistoric tool. Some kind of gnarly old digging tool. <laughs> it's a little diggly stick, um, but not what we were going for, unfortunately, because we have already donated one of those. Uh, let's go ahead and upgrade our watering can. 10,000 gold. That's another thing I'm going to have to be careful about is uh, I need to make sure I reserve enough money to buy seeds for the beginning of uh, spring. Because if I don't, that would really suck. Uh, okay, well we're gonna go ahead and we're gonna go to the bus stop. Oh, not the bus stop, we're gonna go to the mines. Let's go to the mines. Um, now technically you can get the door scroll one by hoeing up any level of the mines, but you also can get them from the lower level monsters. Uh, the bats, bugs, uh, cave fly, duggy, green slime grub, and regular rock crab. Oh, and regular uh, stone golems. Um, so I made a list of the things that I want to attack when I come down here to see if I can get them. But all of those have a half a percent chance of dropping a scroll. Um, oh, look at you. I don't think that luck affects the drop rate of artifacts from, um, monsters. So that'll be kind of my, my focal point. But I think it does affect the, the chance that you get an artifact from hoeing up ground. So I don't know that my neutral luck will be really a good thing in here today. Um, for hoeing up, but I'll do a little bit of hoeing up and see if I can't get something. Uh, but yeah, if you didn't know, you can get artifacts in the mines by hoeing up um, this kind of tillable ground. It's not all artifacts, it's only select artifacts. Wow. Look at that. Took you guys out. But yeah, so theoretically, if I kill 200 monsters, I should get door scroll one. If I do it at this, these levels. Um, I really don't know what the drop rate is of artifacts down here. It's just kind of like sometimes you get them, sometimes you don't. Um, but I think your luck does affect the drop rate quite a bit. Maybe wrong on that, but I think that that's the case. So let's just hoe up a little bit of this ground up here and see if we can't find uh, find the artifact that we're looking for. Yeah. Oh, we got a ladder. That's kind of nice. <gasps> oh, lots of bugs. Good. Come. Come at me, bros. Oh. He came at me hard. Come on! There we go. Cha! One of you gotta have a scroll on you, right? That makes sense. There we go. Cha! I really don't think I'm gonna get an artifact from hoeing with my luck the way it is. We didn't get it. <sighs> That's annoying. Oh, rock crab. Yeah. Take this, bro. Take this, bro. Coming at me now? There he is. Uh, no scroll. 
Uh, and I don't want to go down this whole level. It's just too much. Let's just go to 15. Oh, <laughs> um, took him out with pickaxe. That's kind of funny. Ah, Dougie. Nice. Let's use a um, let's use a cherry bomb on this and see if that gives me anything. Not a thing. Okay, cool. Yeah, yeah. Uh, nothing there. I might actually even try the dark levels just to change it up a little bit, because the golems they can give you the the drop too. So that could be good. There's that guy. And oh, we got a letter. Nice. Alrighty, anybody down here? Yeah, looks like uh, we got an earth crystal, which will come in handy at some point, I'm sure. Uh, I got some monsters up here. Got a bug down here. Oh, come back! How about a doggy? Slime, bug. We still have to kill a whole bunch of slimes in order to get one of the, the achievements as well for the monster hunter stuff. There's that. Oh, a bunch of bugs over here trying to hide from me, are you? That will not work. I s can smell you. You stink bad. Take a shower. Oh, uh, yeah, let's let's go to the dark levels just to change it up a little bit. Let's see how that goes for us. Let's try 35. Oh, yeah, golem. Uh, and a ladder. Okay, that's kind of cool. Um, Anybody else over here? There's some bugs. That could be good. Do we have a glow ring or anything on us? Yeah, we do. Okay, so we should be okay. We should have a little bit of a glow around us. Should make it a lot easier to uh, record in this anyway. So I can actually see what's going on. And you guys can see too, which is nice. Um, I think when I first went through these, I didn't have a glow ring and it was just miserable. I couldn't see anything. I just had to hop from like spotlight to spotlight. That was very annoying. Come on. Why isn't anybody attacking me? There we go. Somebody drop a scroll. All I want is one lousy scroll. And then I'll be happy. Somebody give me a scroll and then I'll be happy. That's how this is going to work. Fortunately, I don't have to worry about damage because I have so much life and I have upgraded armor at this level and a fantastic sword that, eh, like their little hits don't hurt. <laughs> It used to be a big deal when you come through this section the first time, but um, yeah, now I'm pretty good. There we go, there we go. It's like there's a little bit of hoeable ground here, so maybe we'll just do a little bit and see how that goes. Probably not gonna go well, but you know, gotta try. Gotta check under every rock. Not every rock, but you know what I mean. Not literally. Uh, die bug! Somebody give me a dang scroll, please. Nothing there. Oh, bats! I like bats. Freaking bats. I love Halloween. Come on! Die! <gasps> we got it! The door scroll! Oh my gosh, we got it! Oh, it's 6.30, we can't donate it. Oh my gosh, that's so annoying! Oh, it's just 30 minutes past when it closes. Okay, so we finally got the door scroll. The thing I've been trying to get forever. Oh, uh, we finally got it. Oh, thank goodness. Um, To celebrate, <laughs> uh, let's go kill some Desprites, because I need to kill them too. Uh, for the other thing that I want to get to make things in the mines a lot easier. Why are there no monsters today? Jeez. I'm not going to be doing much hoeing anymore because it's kind of a waste of time. Well, it's not really, but um, let's go to like 55. Whoa! I like spawned into a slime. That was interesting. Oh, good. We got a couple guys here. Oh, crystal fruit. Okay. Interesting. Look at all the stuff we just got. <laughs> so many drops. Another ladder. Um, actually, since this is such a big area, let's just hoe this up real quick. Not all of it, but, you know, a big chunk of it. See if we get any cool artifacts. We probably won't because, again, our luck, but you never know. It could be good. If uh, I don't think I have the recipe for lo lucky lunch yet, but if I did, that would be a good thing to uh, to craft and to use. Even when you have good luck, it, um, it helps quite a bit. So I would look forward to that. 
Um, I think one of the new items in the upgraded game is the Lucky Charm. So that will um, permanently give you a luck boost, which is fantastic. Uh, they should have implemented that in the first game. That would have been so great. Be a great late game ad. Uh, all right, let's get a little bit of iron because I think I need iron. And now it's got some monsters to kill. And I am going to uh, pick up all of this quartz because I'm thinking I might want to use crystal flooring in um, in my design, in my final farm, because I think it does look quite nice. It looks kind of whimsical and magical, um, which I like. So I might actually use a fair amount of that, which would require a lot of quartz. Um, but fortunately, you don't have all that much use for quartz. You get way more of it than you actually need. That's for sure. Uh, let's try 65 now. See where that takes us. Ooh, a diamond! That's nice. What a nice little surprise. I might actually save some of these diamonds for gifts too, because there are several people who like diamonds. And like I said, um... Did I say? I don't think I did say. Uh, one of the things we're gonna have to worry, uh, we're gonna have to work on uh, next year that I'm gonna have to refocus on, outside of just focusing on the community center, is focusing on building up relationships with people, uh, focus on getting all of the achievements, and focus on, um, oh, that's really it. But to get all the achievements, we're gonna have to cook all of the dishes. We're gonna have to craft all of the items. And we're gonna have to do like polyculture, which is one of the harder ones, which uh, requires you to, I think, sell 15 of every single crop. <clears throat> so we're gonna have to check the um, our stats in the game. We're gonna have to grow a whole bunch of different crops, not just the money crops, um, but we also have to make a whole bunch of money to do the achievements. So you just have to do a ton of stuff in order to get everything done. I, I'm hoping that we can get all of the achievements done in like around two years. Like that's going to be my goal is to try to get as much done as I can of those in, um, in the second year. I imagine we'll need a third year to polish it off a little bit. I don't know if I'll shoot the whole thing in the Let's Play or not, just depending on if you guys want to see it, of course. Um, but that's going to be kind of my high level plan of how I think this is going to shake out. Uh, all right, let's go. Let's just go ahead and head to the next thing down. Oh, I thought I had a ladder. Guess I don't. Um, yeah, that's fine. I've been trying to find dust sprites, but I'm not really finding many of them, which is very annoying actually, cuz I I want to get the the reward you get from Gil for killing all the dust sprites. Oh, here's some. Oh, crystal fruit. Nice. Uh, let's kill you again. Kill you. Frozen tear. That's interesting. There we go. Uh, let's get a little bit of this iron. Oh, it's midnight already. Oh, jeez. There we go. Um, I'm still so happy that we got the door scroll. That's amazing. Oh, there's another one of you. Let's just pop our head down here and see if there's any dust sprites. I don't see any. I'm not dealing with that big rock. Okay, we're going to head back now because it's already past midnight and we want to sort out our inventory before we head to bed for sure. Let's go to the bus stop. Hop on our horse and our wonky steep and hit the road. Oh, another thing I want to do before, uh, probably at the end of winter. Oh, look at that. We got three diamonds now. That's great. We're going to throw that in the gift chest. Going to throw those in the gift chest. I don't think I'm saving any more of the winter forageables. Um, I don't need to. That's for sure. We're going to keep these um, frozen tears as well because Sebastian loves frozen tears. And how are we on refined quartz? We have 18 bars. We're a little light on iron though so let's go in here and craft up some iron let's say craft up some iron oh i need to make more furnaces i thought i made more furnaces did i not um that's weird i remember doing it but obviously i did it i must have planned it i must have put it on my planner <laughs> and then just not done it that's funny um we'll sell the crystal fruit because why keep it That'll be one thing we do is craft more um, more furnaces for sure. Stone goes in there. We got plenty of stone. We got plenty of copper, so we can definitely do that. We'll sell the the winter root. Put the iron back in here. Bat wings don't go in here. Dwarf scroll. Keep that. Um, yeah, we have seventy nine quartz. That's amazing. Um, earth crystal fiber gold. Nothing else goes in here. Okay, some sort of diggy device. <laughs> That makes me laugh. Uh, sap goes in here, yeah? Maybe? Did I did I move it? I think I moved it. 
Oh, man, I mean, I reorganized everything and now I don't know where anything is. That's annoying. Um, they're not gonna, uh, oh, I do have seeds in here. That's fine. That's right. I did gifts and seeds because I don't know why. <laughs> uh, all right. Let's do bat wings in here. And I'll sell that. I'll sell those. Who cares about? Well, I do need to keep some of those for cooking. I'll probably put them in the fridge. Oh, I think I need a winter root for some for some recipes too. I might, yeah, I might just throw that in the in the chest as well. Not the chest, the the fridge or the chest near the fridge. That might be good too. Sap. Where the heck do I put sap? Did I already just did I just use it all? Am I being crazy? I can never tell if I'm being crazy. I'm just gonna throw it in here. I don't know what else to do with it. I must have used it all for something. I've scared off 13 crows. I'm very proud of you. You're my super sailor. Uh, we're keeping you, we're selling you, we are selling you. I'm just gonna sell the clay because I don't need it. Um, I'm done dealing with all this. <laughs> it's just going away. All right, yeah, and those other two we're gonna put in the fridge. And make sure you head back to your stable. Good night, wonky steed. And you, we're just gonna throw some cave carrots and a winter root in here because I feel like I might need those for a recipe. I might just be crazy. You never really know with me. Oh, really? You're gonna block the doorway? Move, puppy. Come on, I gotta go to bed. Let's go to bed. Yes, let's go to sleep for the night, for sure. Ha ha, but we got the door scroll. That's fantastic. Oh, I'm so happy about that. This was a good call. I was really worried I was going to waste another episode doing this, but uh, it's okay. Uh, so we got $2,600 from, or gold from our um, our artisan goods. Not bad, not great. A little bit from foraging, a little bit from mining, and uh, oh, most of this came from the coffee beans, looks like. So that's good. Uh, but yep, I am going to go ahead and wrap this video up here. Uh, thank you all so much for watching. I hope you did enjoy it. If you did, please leave a, like, uh, leave a like below to let me know that. Don't forget to subscribe to stay up to date with everything going on in the channel. And until next time, I will see you all in the next video. Bye!